Alright everybody, here we are, carp fishing again. Yeah. It's been a while. Today's goal is to try and catch a carp on a lure again. I haven't done this in a very long time. I see a carp right in front of me, right over there. I think I see two of them just in the weeds. I see bubbles. I didn't have any time to tie on like a bug imitation or a lizard imitation, whatever. I've just got this paddle tail with me. Oh, he's eating. He's eating at the bottom. What I'll do is I cast over there. Oh. Oh, nope, 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 bad cast, bad cast. My aim has to be perfect for this. I cast out. Ooh! Uh, let's see if that works. The bubbles have stopped. I think I've spooked the fish. I only have one rod and reel with me today. So, that's all we're fishing with. I don't know, thinking about putting some bait on. I have a can of corn down there. Okay, I got me tent. This thing was like 14 bucks. It's actually not too bad. I don't know why I, I set this up. Oh, oh, oh. Fish on! We got a fish. Let's go. Nice. Nice. <laughs> that didn't take long. Look at that. See, the burly helps. Bring the camera a little bit up. There's a small one, but it's super silver for some reason. Oh, he's all the way in the mud. Oh, he's got me stuck in the mud. If they ever do that, just slowly work it. Don't pull it because they, they'll just snap off. You want to like slowly dislodge it. Just by... Yeah, I'll show you how to do it. If they're stuck in the weeds like that and you can't get them out... Like this one's not too bad. Oh no, he, he's, he's actually stuck. What you got to do is, you want to slowly kind of point its head out so it swim towards you watch like he's he's stuck see that slowly do it and he'll and when he gets a burst of energy he'll kind of take him he'll kind of like come out see just like that see if I pulled any harder that thing would have snapped okay, it's pretty dry around here chuck the rod We'll get this fish. Look at that, that's a nice sized carp. Why is there no fish biting? Where are the fish? Come on fishy. Where you at? This cast is a little bit further. Let's see how that it goes. How that it goes. Let's see how it goes. Come on, just one more bite. So I can go home. I think I'm running out of camera. Um, is that a bite? Is that a bite? No, it's a wind. I'm running out of um, memory storage. So. That's a bite, that's a bite. Oh, I predicted the bite. No way, no way I just predicted the bite. Ah, oh, and he left. Oh. Is he still on? I think he's still on. Yes, he's still on. Let's go, oh, oh. Oh, he's in there, he's in there. He's way in there. Oh my God. I just predicted the bite. Oh my God, there's no way I just done that. Look at that, he's all the way in there. This is how I can get him out. Come on, carp. I can get you out. <laughs> there is no, I just touched the rod and I was like, come on. 
another fish so I can go home. Ooh. This is a nice fish. Come in here, carp. Thank you so much for biting. Yeah, he's a bit of a nicer one. He's like 60 centimeters or 50. I reckon he's like 55. Oh shit, almost died. Okay, let's bring him up. The more he splashes, the more he kicks his tail, the more he'll jump right into the, the land. You just gotta see. The more he does that. Now I'm gonna go grab it and hope to God that tail doesn't splash me in the face. He's a nice fish. He's a chunky fish. <laughs> Ooh. Look at that. Oh. Gotta get used to this angle. Look at that. Another nice sized fish. That's a big guy. If only I could catch a snapper about that big, that would be something. Here's my knife. That was like perfect timing. I just touched the rod and I was like, please uh, bite again for another fish so I can go home. And he just bit. But we're gonna throw out another rod, another line. Give it another 10 minutes. Ooh, a pelican. Ooh, two big pelicans. Okay, that's not a good cast. Yeah, let's cast over there again. I hope those pelicans come this way and take the carp. The carp is just around here. Oh, not a fish! Not a fish! That looked like a redfin for some reason. Oh, it's definitely a carp. He jumped up and he showed his red fins. That's a carp, it's a small one. Oh my god, what a jump! What a jump! Guys, freaking feisty. Look at this. I think this guy thinks he's a salmon. We've got three carp. That one swallowed the hook. I accidentally cut the line, but he swallowed the hook. So yeah, when you're using a rig as simple as this, which is just a hook and a split shot, you don't really, it's not really the end of the world if you ended up gut hooking a fish because you just cut the hook out. Or just cut the line, leave the hook in the fish. Let's chuck it out. Put it in the holder, wait for another fish. I just saw my line twitch. Yeah, is that a bite? I feel like that's a bite. That is a bite. Let me hold it, I'll feel it. Yeah, that's a bite. That's definitely a bite. Come on, he's just got to take it a little bit more. Yes! Let's go! Another fish! We got another one! <laughs> nice work! <laughs> Drag's a bit tight. Sheesh! Eight pound line! That's all you need, eight pound line. I mean, if some people are using, people in the UK are using 20 pound line, I reckon eight pound line's plenty. None of our fish get, none of our carp get up to the UK size. Look at that, oh, barely hooked as well. Barely hooked. 
Oh, it's another nice fish. Okay, let's go dispatch him. Pretty impressed. This is on one camera. This is, one, this is on one battery. An hour 15. With 15% left, I can probably do another 15 minutes of filming. Or maybe even 20. Pretty impressed with this battery life. Plenty of GoPros are getting good with their battery life. It's about time. <laughs> oh, another fish. Another fish taking it. Fish on. Fish on. Oh my god, look at that jump. Look at that jump. Oh my god, this guy's got so much energy in him. These fish. Oh my god. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, I can feel him. I can feel him. He's rubbing me against all the weeds. Come on, get yourself out of there. Slowly taking him out. Oh, I can feel the line in the weeds. Yeah, he's, he's swimming to... Oh, no, he's not. No, he's not. He's not swimming towards me. Do you feel that? Do you guys see that? Look at the, look at the end of the rod. That's the weeds. That's me slowly pulling the fish in out of the weeds come on it's gonna be a tough fight yes he's out he's out he is out we got him out nice You know, is this the biggest one of the day? This has to be the biggest one of the day. Oh, it's taking me to another weed. It's taking me to the other side. Come on. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. Oh, he's a good sized fish, yo. Yo, this is a good sized fish. Oh. Imagine taking him out of that snag over there only to get him snagged in again over here. Imagine if I lose him right there. That would be so sad. I should have lost him over there, if anything. If you find yourself in this position, don't be too scared, I guess. Just slowly work him out. It's just a game of patience. You've got to slowly work him out. Otherwise, you will not get him out. You will not get the fish out. He's a good sized fish, yo. Yo, he's a big one. What's my PB, like 83 or 81? I don't think this is, I don't think this is gonna be 80 something, but. He's coming in close, I reckon. I haven't caught an 80 centimeter carp in like what, five years? Oh, he's chunky. He's a chunky fish. I reckon this guy's the one I saw over there. When we first started, when we first came here, I reckon this is the same one because the one I saw over there, its tail was like the size of my hand. Or at least its fin was the size of my hand. Oh, this is, this is tough, this is tough. Should have bought the net. Jeez, imagine if I was using eight, uh, I'm using eight pound. Imagine if I was using six pound line. How hard would that be? Oh, he's a slob. I don't know if I can use that same method of getting it in if he's that big. I don't know if I can. Where's my net? There it is, there it is, we got the fish, no way, no way that just happened. Oh, look at that fish, there is no way. Look at that massive car, he's a big fish man, he's a nice sized car, this will get a few, this will get a lot of eggs out of the water. These things are illegal to release back in our waters, look at him, there is no way.
<laughs> There's no way I just caught that fish. This is the fish we were chasing. This, I think this is the fish. I believe this is the fish we saw when we were trying to catch him with lures. And I spooked him. But he came back and he bit it. Look at that. Thank you so much for biting, man. Too bad I gotta kill this guy. I hate killing carp, but I'm not trying to risk getting a $10,000 fine. I'm broke as it is. Well, I reckon this is gonna be it for today's video. There's a pelican circling us. I'm not sure where he's at, but he did see these carp laying down here. So I reckon I'm gonna give these to the two pelicans that have been chilling and uh, eyeing this carp out. Those two pelicans are gonna have a good feed. So I guess the foxes and uh, dingoes or whatever's out here won't eat that badly. That's the end of today's video. I'll see you on the next one. Subscribe.